Hi, this is Monica, and we've been asked to make a video to help you look for damage on Chromebooks. So you're gonna fill out the same form you did last year, but I've got Cade, the expert man here, who's gonna answer some questions for us. And um, we wanna make their jobs a little bit easier as they check thousands and thousands of Chromebooks this summer. So Cade, um, I know one of the things is the bezel damage. Can you show mm -hmm. us some examples of what the bezel damage would look like? Sure. So some things we can check for for the bezel. You'll be able to notice on here if it's sticking up a little bit on the corners, say like right here and here, yeah, you can usually just push down on it a little bit. If it kind of flexes and bounces, you'll know that you have an issue. You can even use your thumb just to pull it up a little bit, yeah. and then you'll know for sure it's broken. Okay, and that goes under screen damage, right? Uh, yeah, if there's uh, any basically extra damage on here besides just the bezel, then it'll be under screen damage. Does a bezel ever break on the top or is it always on the bottom there? Uh, usually only on the top. Okay. Yeah, we've found that quite often. So, okay. some issues we find with that. Uh, cracked screens, mm -hmm. most cracked of the time screens, is obvious, yeah. but mm -hmm. is there any time it's not obvious? There can be. Uh, there can be times where you'll see just a little discoloration, sometimes on the corner or along the side where it'll be black and it'll look like just a little bit of a, a odd, uh, odd shape on there. And I have a, sent you a picture you can put on there okay. for later, but just to kind of find that, you can run your finger along the screen like that. And, and any see, kind of discoloration means yeah, there's a crack screen. See, discoloration, there'll be a crack on there. Okay. So it'll be pretty easy to see once you do that. Awesome. Um, so loose keys, mm -hmm. I, obviously if they're gone or broken, that's yeah. obvious, but what's what, what kind of key can be fixed, I guess? So any most keys like this, they're just popped up a little bit. Uh, we can usually push them back down on there, and they'll be kind of clicks. all right. Yeah, like this <laughs> one's not a good not. example, but okay, that's going to be a, a little bit key. of a broken key. Yeah. Uh, if any of these like little metal pieces are completely broken off, like get the keys off, mm -hmm. those are ones we can't re fix, unfortunately. Sure. So we need a new keyboard. Okay. Um, missing screws. So I know that some of the screws are sometimes missing. Where do we even look for those? So you want to look for, on most Chromebooks, they'll be on the bottom of it, on the bottom plate here. And on the Yogas in particular, and a lot of students have those, they'll okay. be uh, missing on the top left corner usually, or on the top right many times. Okay. And just let us know, and we'll get some more screws in there for you. Uh, there are times where these won't stay in the corner, because it's a bad thread in many cases, and it won't, there's nothing to grab onto. So sometimes they can't be fixed for that corner. Okay. Um, touchpad not working, we need to check for that. Yep. Um, power button not working, is there a yes. key to looking at those? Yep, any of the yogas here for the power button, uh, you'll hear a little bit of a click if it's working. Uh, for ones that aren't, you'll have honestly no resistance whatsoever, it'll just go in there and nothing will, it won't have anything pushing back at all. Okay. So you'll know from that. Alrighty, and then maybe headphone jacks. That's another mm -hmm. problem that we have. What do we need to do about that? And usually you can just look on the side here. You'll usually see something broken off inside from the headphones. Or if you take a pair of headphones, just put it in real fast, see if it goes down all the way, then you'll know if there's anything stuck in there, if it's kind of out a little bit from the jack. All right, anything else we need to look for when doing our quick checkout for these Chromebooks? Uh, yeah, if there's anything, uh, any major scratches on it, for example, anything like that from Wolverine, um, or if you have some, you know, artists trying to make graffiti. some graffiti in the Chromebook like say. that, Tech for Life. Totally. I don't know who would have done that, but mm -hmm. yeah, anything like that you want to look for be something will mark as damage for that. <laughs> so. All right. Well, we thank all the work that you do, Cade. We know you work hard on these Chromebooks, and we'll do thank our you. best to find those um, problems and get them pointed out on our sheet. All right. Thank Thanks. you, Monica.